Hey guys, <clears throat> Angry Joe here, and I am working on the last top list simultaneously. They will be coming out over the weekend. We have the best games of 2013, and then top 20 games of 2014. It's taking me a little bit longer. I'm working on them at the same time. Um, so I'm doing a little let's play here for you. Now I've got a new capture cable for my iPad, which is going to allow me to show you guys in better detail what's happening on the mobile side of gaming. Not often. I don't want to do these particular videos often. Just every once in a while when something particularly bad or really good comes out. Um, now I mentioned this title in the Star Trek Trexels video as a freemium type game, uh, but one that wasn't quite as bad as Star Trek Trexels, but a few of you had said that, Joe, you actually need to continue to play the game, um, so we'll do that and we'll see if it gets worse or better um, along the game. So let's dive in and actually see what's here. Click the people, they all do their little animations. This is my squad that I built up. It's a squad of, of five champ, five heroes rather, um, you know, four humans and one dragon. Now you'll see at the bottom of their base is their different uh, qualities. So gold is a rare. The red ones, these two, are uh, epics, and the green one, uh, as you can see, Morgan is a legendary, and uh, you can get these different heroes what they try to do in this game is have you open up packs like booster packs like you're trying to open up a pack of uh and see what you get whether you're getting a common uncommon or a rare epic or legendary you have to go uh to this section here and as you play the game you earn in-game gold and the in-game gold um you can use to either purchase recruit packs or soldier packs now, you know what sucks here is that they haven't, you know, m mentioned what the drop rates are uh, it, for rare, epic, and legendaries in the recruit packs versus the soldier packs. So you really have no idea which is the better one. Because if you look, the recruit pack is 350 gold, and the soldier pack is a lot more expensive, almost four times more expensive um, at 1,500 gold. Um, the soldier pack uh, guarantees you at least an uncommon with a chance at rare epic legendary and the recruit is a guaranteed common which is the lowest uh, that there possibly is and now it's time to actually spend real money this is probably going to get me upset so if I yell and scream I apologize but uh, I got a bunch of gems here. I'm gonna spend them so you get to watch my gems uh, deplete so that you can laugh at my pain or my gain, hopefully. Okay, so I hope this is gonna be entertaining. Do a 10 champion pack. Holy freaking shit. 10 packs for the price of nine. So how much is that? Well, I will tell you. So if you go to the gem screen here, 425 for $30, 275 for $20. So if you bought the 275 and you bought the 46 gem and the 22 gem, that is the exact cost. So $4, $2 plus $20, that's $26. I'm about to spend $26 worth of gems here for your entertainment pleasure. Oh my god, I actually hit the button. Oh sh! I just did it! Oh my god, 10 champions! That's a lot of freaking money! <laughs> we just wasted about $30 worth of money here, boom! Rare! Arcane Warrior! And a rune! Next! Come on, big money, big money, big money! Boom! Rare! Dalish Warrior and a rune. Okay, come on now. Give us something better. Papa needs a brand new pair of shoes. Boom, rare. God darn it. Desire Demon. Not very desirable. And a rune. This one's like guaranteed runes. And come on. God darn it, rare. With a rune. Come on guys, come on guys, I'm waiting for that epic, that legendary, I bought 10 of them, how can this be possible? Okay, that's fine, 
I, what number are we on? I've lost track already. Come on. Let's see this. Another rare. Boom. Charged Slavan. If I pronounce that right. With a rare. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Because I haven't seen an epic or a legendary. Spent a lot of money in this. Oh, come on. Rock Wraith. With, I think, that is a rare um, rune. Or a uh, epic rune. Because it was a red looking thing. Or it could have been a common rune. Oh my gosh. Okay. Come on now. This is like the last one or the second to last one. Give it to us. Give it to us. It was a green. Oh my god. Oh, what? What? It changed? It changed into an epic? Sebastian! Hell yeah! Woo! We got a good one. <laughs> Damn right we did. For that many freaking gems. And then this, this has to be the last one here. And dang it. Oh, yeah, it's, it turned into rare. Okay, Inferno Golem. Oh my god, look at that health. Look at that freaking power. This dude is insanely powerful. Awesome. Done. So, yeah, we got some pretty cool fucking guys there. Is it what? Is it $30 cool? Hell no. <laughs> I don't think so. Let us slot in our freaking new badass heroes all right infernal golem looks to be 311 uh 1521 versus 161 and 456 yeah uh infernal golem is coming in boom i mean look at how huge this power is and it's essentially because i spent money and i found him in the freaking packs so, pay to win? Yes. There's no denying that. Okay. What else? Sebastian? We gotta put Sebastian on our team. Let's see. 150. Who can we get rid of? Now, oh, this Grey Warden, man. He's been loyal to me. He really has. 505, 192 chance. 2% uh, attacks one enemy and gains power. Or we can switch him out with Sebastian, which has a little bit more health. But... A little bit less power uh, but he is definitely has a higher ceiling because uh, the Grey Warden only goes up to level 30 he's a level 9 right now and Sebastian will go all the way up to level 50 so unfortunately we gotta take Sebastian which is gonna give him a little bit of uh, bonus health he attacks one enemy and gains power so pretty much just like the previous guy just a higher ceiling on that so now I've decked out my squad with all epics and one legendary so yeah let's go beat some face online now now I'm a level 6 and it stacked me up against a level 11 because of my guys they're all 15, 16, 16, 14. And I've got a level 1 and a bunch of others. Let's just fight and see what happens. So I should be killed if leveling uh, is the most important aspect. Let's check it out. So I'm glad that Sebastian attacks first. Um, but I miss my dragon. Oh, come on. we got to bring down that big guy. And they're not even bothering attacking the big guy anymore. There he goes. Big guy's down. Sebastian. Taking out those one-on-ones. Oh, I've lost a troop. Boom, boom. Smash his face. I like this attack. Oh, sweet. And we did it. Killed him. Even though his level is way above ours. He was a level, I think, 11, and we were a level 6. We just dealt way more damage, and we had way more starting health. And I think that's because of my epic golem. And my epic golem is getting stronger. Nice. Morgan. Morgan. 
Morgan leveling up. Sebastian leveling up. All right. So now that we're done beating Face Online, let's go back to the store since we earned up a lot of gold in our battles. And let's try to get four or five packs of these. So, soldier pack, go. You better not give us crap. You better not give us crap. Give us something good. Son of a bitch, you gave us crap. Kirkwall guard. No, buy another. Ready? You better not give us crap. You better not give us crap. You better not give us crap. And god darn it. Another uncommon. Buy another. You better not give us crap. You better not give us crap. And... God dang it! The same freaking one! This bullshit! Starting to piss me off! Cause these are like... This is like hours of grinding. Well, 30 minutes of grinding. Oh, Deer? You gave me a deer? Seriously? God dang it! One more! We got one more! Give us an epic, le epic legendary or freaking, I don't know, god darn it! Another deer! Give me a break! I spent 1,500 gold and you give me a freaking deer! Twice! It's so pissed off! Unbelievable! God dang it! Uh, pisses me off. Look, I could rotate the deer. Well, good for you! Done. Now, so what good is all this crap? If it made us upset, well, what you could do, since we have a bunch of heroes now, we can do some combining or we can do some consuming. Yeah, alright. It's time to combine some rares to get this big bad boy up to par. We're going to take the uh, the silly sisters here. Yes, I want to sacrifice a rare hero. Yes, I want to sacrifice a rare hero. I don't care. And then we'll freaking sacrifice some deer. Those are always good to sacrifice. No, I want it in a very specific way. And an archer and a deer. Okay. Oh my gosh, that's a ton of freaking thing to sacrifice. All for my mega. This is like hours of grinding. <laughs> so let's hit consume. You better go up. One. Come on, two. Give us another. Three. Keep going. Four. Five. I mean, six. Okay, six. Can we come? Oh, come on. You can't stop at six. You gotta go to seven, man. You gotta go to seven or ten. All right, sweet. All right, now with this freaking epic badass team, let's see if we can go questing in the area uh, that I was getting my ass kicked earlier, the Rise of the Carta. This is the first time the game really has, opens up its, its big brick paywall where it's really difficult to defeat these enemies unless you've been grinding uh, for quite some time. So, <clears throat> this one kicked our ass last time. Keep going. As their numbers dwindle, the Carta become desperate and violent. With a lack of leadership to rein in their excesses, they begin to lose their sense of dwarven honor, causing them to freely break their word and double-cross their allies. And this is the Carta leader. Defeat the Carta leader. This is the last one here. We're going to get ten gems out of this, I think. And that's what that last screen said. There he is. And it's an easy... Let's freaking do it. Boom, 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 boom. They're all on quick. Every single one of those guys was quick. So let's fucking smash them into the ground. That was sweet. Slow it down now so we can get the epic. We can get the juiciness of him going down in slow motion. <laughs> boom. Sit down, son. Victory. New map unlocked. The freaking Carter Assassins had nothing on me. We leveled up to level 7, so all the energy and stamina have been refreshed. There's three more in this one. I can't enter this one right now. I have to wait 11 minutes. But, 
What I can do is take my badass team, battle online, and beat the hell out of people. Ooh, this one, level 15? Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. and a Dark Revenant and a Desire Demon. Oh, this one I think is going to be our first loss, guys. I think this is going to be the first loss. This is going to be an epic battle here. Oh, man, I'm going to leave this on normal mode here. Boom, yeah, barely any damage from Sebastian, barely any damage from Alistair. Here comes the big boy bear, the Dark Revenant. Oh, God, that Dark Revenant does so much damage. Ooh, I did a double damage. That's really going to help out. Wow, that guy attacks all four of my my uh, troops there. I really need to pick up a mage. I'm on my back foot here. I need to take out somebody. I need to take out somebody quick. They keep lowering my initiative. There I go. I just took out that Dark Revenant. That's going to give me a huge advantage now. He did, manages to take out my epic, but now it is over. Woo! That was a that was a, a close battle. I didn't know which way that one was going to go, but we took it. Level up. Got a little bit uh, less gold, actually, a little bit more gold, and I think it's because of the fact. That we're taking on people that are uh, higher levels than we are. I'm only a level seven, while uh, these guys are, you know, level 14s. Holy shit! We got dealt our first defeat. Oh my god, I did not expect that whatsoever. Oh my god. It was likely because they had two double damage hits. And, uh, yeah. And it seemed as if they had quite a bit of starting health. TMC forgot to check his level at the beginning of that battle. So if you lose, you're losing trophies, you're not getting very much gold, and you're not getting very much experience. So that is uh, pretty shitty. Now you can retry the duel. I don't know why you would want to retry the duel. I guess in the case that you think the double damage is what won it. In fact, let's retry the duel. Because I want to know what the guy's level was. Okay, see, he's a level 24, that's why. We're a level 8, he's a level 24. If we look at his, uh, his troops here, they're all level, you know, 34, 30, 29, 24, 16. This is a really uh, insanely difficult fight. We wouldn't win it. Um, we get close, but we're just not, not there. Now, all of a sudden, it's Ninoy at level 15 they must have found somebody a little bit closer to our level according to the game and replaced it so I didn't even get to do the rematch this this one we should smash oh they're getting a little close quite a bit of health on there big boy there that that was close quite a bit of health So yeah, that's it. Uh, if you play this game, know what you're getting into. You can pretty much play it for free up until map 4. Um, after that, you, EA expects you to pay them <laughs> between 60 to $80 uh, to compete with the higher level teams online or to progress through some of the extremely difficult maps towards the end. Uh, and if you just want to download it for free, you can do that and grind for possibly hours, days probably weeks actually uh, to accomplish the same thing. 
you know, it never ceases to amaze me when I find a game like this. Um, you know, it's very light, fun. It, it's not that involved, uh, but it does have the potential to just be like a, you know, uh, something that you do in your your pastime while you're waiting in line or something. It has this potential if they reduced the freaking prices and increased the drop rates. They would make a lot more money if that's their only freaking goal. Um, and some people may not mind it as others as there there are some actual battles here as opposed to Star Trek Trexels where it's just timers waiting for timers waiting for timers. At least there's some content here. But, um, okay, I hope that's helpful uh, for you guys if you ever saw this game on the Android store, the uh, iPhone or the iPad, uh, and you were worried about, uh, you know, whether you'd have to drop a ton of money. So there's your answer, okay, guys, and uh, I will see you on the next Angry Joe Show with those top lists.